Hi YouTube, this is Ice Marie Lowe, back with another video. Now I know it's been a little while, but I've been working on some portraits and stuff, so um, I'm back with another video. I am really hot right now, but I've actually turned my fan off because our five minutes of summer in the UK is over. So um, I think I might put on a different top and get started. This is where it all begins, guys. Infinite possibilities. Until you mess up, put one line down and mash up the whole program so basically what i've done is i've uploaded a picture that i've had on there for ages that i put on there for um the curly hair videos now i really wanted to do a line of videos with different curl patterns but i found it hard to find different curl patterns and a large image size picture on google so what i did was just find my favorite ones this is a beautiful young lady i'm not going to draw the glasses and whatnot but i definitely am going to draw her hair because it is on fleek her hair looks absolutely amazing and if i zoom in you can actually see the definition of the curls, which is probably going to be a bit of a challenge, but I like a challenge. You will never grow as an artist if you don't try to do things that, um, that challenge you. Is so I'm going to start by drawing her jawline and her chin. And let me just come out a little bit. Because once I do that, I can then put some black pastel all around here and I can feel more confident in getting the right shape for all of the hair. I like to put things in the center most of the time, depending on the image. Sometimes it, it, it just looks right on one side, but it's very rare that I do that. I like to put it central. So um, what I would do is look at her face and, and her face is literally right in the middle. So I'm going to start drawing her jawline right in the middle. Once you've done the jawline, most of the image, you can still see the image, right? Most of the image is hair, as you can see. I'm not going to draw down under the shoulders. Um, and then her face is kind of small in the middle, a little neckline and a shoulder there. So it's like, for me, drawing this would be a little bit more simple. I'm going to get started now. It will be a lot easier once I start with the pastel. I've got the pastel here. Um, I'm just going to basically throw down the pastel because, like I, like I say, all her hair is black. And obviously the, um, the light is hitting the curls in certain ways and they're kind of highlighted. But I will use the eraser for that. Um, I just love these large image size pictures, it's amazing. So I'm gonna get started now, guys.
Okay guys, so that's that side done. I wanna get started on this side. I still need to highlight some of these because my cat slid down here again. So he smudged it. I did um, rub out the stuff from around the outside, but I need to make sure I highlight those parts. I'm gonna do that in a minute. But I'm about to get started on here. What I'm gonna do is exactly the same as what I did that side. I'm just gonna throw down some soft pastel, um, rub it in really quickly, use the eraser to get the lines, and then the hard bit for me comes in where you've got to define the curls and whatnot. But hopefully I can get it done pretty quick. Um, I doubt very much I can get it done in an hour, but I'm going to get started anyway and see how I get on. If you haven't yet subscribed guys, don't forget to subscribe, like and comment, and please do share, share on your social medias, share to anybody that you think would be interested in some of my videos. Um, there's a lot of people out there that are fascinated with art, and I just want to get my videos out to those people. Um, don't forget to add me on Instagram and Snapchat guys, as well as Marie on both of those. And yeah, just continue to support me, and I'll continue to keep pushing out these videos. Yeah, anyway guys, I'm going to jump in. I'm going to get all the black pastel laid down here. I'm probably going to speed that part up because you, you know the process for that part. Um, and then, yeah, I'm just going to get down to this definition. That's the hardest part. But once I've got this out of the way, this time I'm going to take a photograph. So stick to the end. I'm going to take a decent photograph of this and I'm going to, um, I'm going to put it at the end of the video so you get to see the complete portrait. Mm -hmm. 